Hello fellow lost soul, would you like to have purpose in your life? And would that purpose perhaps be in line with our absolutely super cool cult that you can join? Well if that's the case, you've come to the right place. My name is Koifish and today I will be your cult leader as I will form the most powerful warband of cultists devout followers of a dark god by the name of Davkul in the game Battle Brothers. Battle Brothers is usually a game where you play as a mercenary company, but using the campaign start Davkul Cultist, you can turn this from trying to earn as much money and fame as possible to seeking ultimate salvation in the flock of the devoted. It's time to start the most devious cult in all of Battle Brothers. And with that somber note, I would like to welcome you to my small congregation of followers. Here we have Ludolf, he's a bit of a goofy fellow and he does not like having his face be seen. Ebron, who's an absolute madman when it comes to using the flame. Trisu, who's a bit kinky. He goes into battle naked with a leather hood and that's right, a battle whip. He owns multiple whips, but this one he keeps for battle. And lastly, my favorite, Volker. Volker is actually quite beautiful. He only wears the hood to fit in with Ludolf, his big time crush. Now less talking and more, well, cult stuff. Dovkul awaits us all, but first we have to wait for him to show up. So while we do that, we might as well earn some money. Being a cult doesn't pay for itself. We need to have day jobs. Wow, what a beautiful, I take that back. I was gonna say this was a nice place, but it smells like fish and the locals look at me funny. Let's see if we can recruit someone. A vagabond, a few fishermen, and Ingolf, a grave digger. Tell you what, I think it just fits. We're gonna hire this guy and the vagabond. We've been hired to kill some brigands. Yeah, I can do that. Southeast. Oh, these tracks. <laughs> yeah, I can do that. I feel like that's not above my pay grade. Thieves, come here. This is gonna be one easy fight. Come on, men of ill repute. It's time for me to show you what the Davkul cult is all about. Whipping people into submission. Well, that sounds more kinky than I want it to be. Or does it? I'm gonna walk up and I'm gonna schmunk this man. And while we're at it, let's whip him to death. Or let's steal this guy's pickaxe. I missed. Ah, come on. Your battle whip should be better than that. Oh, careful now, Ludolf. Better keep that hood on. Uh oh. Ludolf! Ah! He's hideous! That's one man schmunked. That's another man schmunked. I have more. You Ow! We whipped them to death! It's a great first fight. This man took a bunch of damage and got a fractured hand. But don't worry, bones do grow back. You guys have like a temple? No? That's too bad. We do have a bit of money, so we could hire another guy. A bowyer, a cripple, or a fellow cultist? Let's hire this man. Let's get you a padded surcoat, a shield, and a mighty cleaver. You look terrified. Also, Friso, I'm gonna have to put on a bit of clothing for you. You're being too kinky. I don't like it. We've been getting complaints. We're going to Hatlund. Sure thing. I've been to Hatlund. That's where I came from. Dovkul Moonlights as a postal service. Ambition has been fulfilled and the company has gained some very nice renown. We have to hunt monsters. I can do that. Webknechts. Oh, is that dangerous? Editor Sorax, on a scale of 1 to 10, how dangerous will this be? Well, too bad that I can't talk to you because you're editing this video after the fact that I've recorded it. Let's go. Oh, spiders. This is perfect. My editor is highly arachnophobic. I find this very amusing. <laughs> Does this scare you, editor? Come on, hold your ground. If you get stuck in a sticky situation, don't worry. It's just spiders. Oh no, we're all getting webbed. We can do this. I believe in us. Nothing we can't whip our way through. Come here. These spiders have a very strong bite to them. Keep whipping, you shad. We bested them. Very good. And we got Gossamer. So it's like a bunch of sticky stuff. I love it. Yeah, no, that was quite scary. I'm gonna go back to Hatlund. Very good. We've saved the village. So far, we're sort of the good guys. I'm supposed to be a cult, but I guess good branding never hurts. I've traveled over to Himmelsvasht. And what do I find? Wilderish the Follower. A fellow cultist. He carries a very cool note. It reads... <laughs> How quaint. Welcome to the fold, fellow brother. Oh my lord, we can buy dogs? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna buy a few dogs. That's like ridiculously cool. That costs most of our money. But I have a strong feeling that it's gonna be totally worth it in the end. We're like really good people. We have dogs. Escorting a caravan. I can do that. See? The cult of Dovkul. We're cool guys. We're having a fresh start, guys. The Dovkul's chosen are not the bad guys. I think we're gonna buy ourselves a battle stand. Yeah, that's what we'll do. It's gonna cost us 2,000 crowns. We can easily make that by just doing some errands. But you know what we can get here? Fresh haircuts! And even better, we can all get matching tattoos 
and matching beards. Now that screams cult. All right, fine. We can have different beards. Now we are talking. That's what I call proper unity. We are all brothers in baldness. Dovkul hates hair. <laughs> then we'll take on a bigger work, a big job. Something that pays. That's not even an impressive contract. We're just going to Tiefenhaven. Glorified postal service. So far, we're not even a cult. That's gonna change. I feel Dovkul's presence. He is behind every corner, behind every mailman. I used to beat up some more spiders, and Oscar here, one of my cultists, is sitting on his knees. His body swaying back and forth as he nurses a wound. You hear muffled cries in between all two loud moans. Approaching, you ask the man if he's alright. He shakes his head. And explains that this was his first taste of real vicious combat. It was not what he expected. And he's not sure if he can continue. Listen. There's not a soul here who isn't scared. He will be still by combat. Or he will be killed by it. My little boy. You will. It's gonna be fine. You're a cultist goddammit. Dovkul awaits. You shouldn't be afraid of it. It's gonna happen eventually. Did Koifish seriously hit him with the. Yeah you're gonna die eventually. You don't be scared. Yeah. Yeah I guess. Dovkul. God damn it. Give me a sign. I'm waiting for you. We're eagerly awaiting to do your bidding. But first. We're gonna get a lockbox from a bunch of thieves. We can do that. Absolutely my dudes. Come back here thieves. I will show you what those who steal get done to them. They send the cult after him. <laughs> gonna get you. You not gonna escape, come here! You think you're fearsome men, huh? Come on then, brigands, get over here! Oh, they're all quite clumped up. If we deal more damage to them than they did to us, we will win, and they will die. Send the dog on the side, and start whipping! Go get them! Steven the dog! <laughs> he bit him to death! Careful, gentlemen, they're gonna swing back! Don't let them kill you! Kill them first! The pitchfork strat is wonderful. It's just an extra embarrassment on top. Steve George! And then Abraham, my, my one of the dogs. I got so many dogs, I'm gonna forget their names. Get them, Abraham! Oh, yeah! Oh, he's leaving. Something tells me we're gonna be able to run them down pretty easily. There's no retreating from this. The dogs will catch you, and it's gonna hurt. Like, really, really bad. Don't, don't try to hit my dog, you madman. That's not gonna work out well for you. Oh, no, he's, he's done for. He's done for. Goodbye, sir. No one runs from the cult. Very good. We've gained ourselves a battle standard. <gasps> and we got a discount on it. Very, very good. These are our colors. Who wields them? Volker, you will carry our banner into battle. Volker the banner man. I don't trust Ludolf to do it. He's too vain. We'll take this quest no matter what it is. Get the fruit of the debaucher of the long lost key. Yeah, I can do that. He's just retrieving a flute. Is this gonna be the most dangerous job we've ever done? Something tells me yes. But I do not care. But I do care about seeing stuff. We're gonna camp out here and have a lovely time together. Nothing like hanging out with your cultist friends and camping. But I'm being attacked? From where? From what? I have no idea. But I'm frankly quite scared. Whatever it is, let them come to us. Zombies? Tell you what. We will fight. We will hold. You undead schmunks. I will cut you down. Get your shields up, brothers. Spears in the front. Just a bunch of raggedy bones, huh? A bunch of bony lads. <laughs> Oi, they hit quite hard. Ibrod is in a bad spot. Hit hard and slay these invaders. Break his shield. Come on. And start stabbing at them. Don't let these zombie skeletons get the best of us. We're a cult, gosh darn it. We should not be afraid of this. Dovkul is a mightier enemy. Now watch this. Our banner and our dogs. See, dogs, they love bones. They sort of eat at them. It only makes sense. Another dog to the war fight. Gosh darn it, I love my dogs. They're so funny. Oh, did someone die? Oh, I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm scared. No one died, right? Finish these boners. Come on, kill them all. I will use your bones as toys for my dogs. Is there a guy missing? I can't, I have the sneaking feeling that someone died. Where's... Where's the guy with the flail? Emerald! You got your ear taken off! Well, at least you're not dead, and that's good. I can't believe we got attacked! That wasn't even the main thing! We're gonna go in, and we're gonna mess this camp up! Shield walls, my gentlemen! Shield walls! Spear walls! We can do this! That's a good start! Guys, you're, you're dead! I mean, like, you're dead, dead, but also, like, get with the tides. Hopefully, we can get one out even before the battle starts. But it ain't looking great. I'll be honest. We'll unleash the war dogs. They need to help out. But Ebrold, you're far too weak to attack. Unleash the hounds and snatch his weapon. <laughs> no weapon for you. Hit and crush. These bag of bones will be nothing when I'm done with them. We'll send out one dog and we'll cut that man down. These dogs have been a great asset for the company. They're the best boys, huh? Who knew that dogs were this good at attacking skeletons, huh? Now, if only they would have notified us about the dogs in the first place, this battle could have been avoided. <laughs> a mighty bit of fighting. Crack his shield and slice at his neck. 
I have uh, uh, vertebrae, I guess. That's good. Now we're talking. Whip him to death. Oh, we're taking a lot of these unnecessary damages, but we're gaining a lot of loot. And a signature. Nice. Well, the fruit is ours. We're gonna head back. Ka-ching! Ernst! Ernst walks beside you. He calls you an aspect of Davku's darkness, and that eternal eyes surely watch over your parties as a whole. The Davku shows and takes him beneath its many shadow wings. Yes, join us. Ernst! Ernst, my boy! Look at you! Wonderful! Another follower! Now we just need two more guys and we'll have a roster of 12 men. We're currently taking a bit of a package down to Al Anwar. 410 crowns. A nice little paycheck. Let's see if we have any fellow brothers here. Siegbold the Believer. Yeah, you sound like one of us. I'm gonna hire you. We need every brother we can get. And just like that, we have a lot of numbers. Very great. What's this then, huh? 940 crowns? Uh, yeah, I'll take it. We're going to Thor. How bad can that be, huh? A few brothers have come to you looking rather worried. They say Siegbold the Believer, a man we just picked up, has been sitting with Ingolf, uh, one of our spearmen, for a few hours. When you ask what's the worry, they remind you that the cultist has a scarred forehead and speaks of incredibly strange things. Those are the demands of Davkur, all right. An example of one's commitment. I go and see the two men. Ingolf looks up at me, smiling. It says that the cultist actually has a lot to teach him. I will show him darkness. By next morning, Ingolf is found with a fresh wound on his forehead. The blood of conversion. And the price some must pay to be devoted to Davkul. He's a cultist. Ingolf, my friend. You've been converted. Very nice. Look at all of these cultists, huh? That's a bunch of them. Now we just need to convert this guy. And you're the Mark Olf, you're the odd one out. Imagine how he feels. <gasps> Davkul's presence. Arrived during a campfire. The rest of the men faded into an aether of infinite black. An entity which you could not see, but whose presence was but a penumbra of crossing shadows. It requested a sacrifice! Not speaking to you, but showing Siegbold the Believer and Ernst. It was clear that Davkul was trusting you with a choice. <gasps> Siegbold the Believer and Ernst were staring at you. Who do we sacrifice? Siegbold the Believer converted one man. Ernst was the man that just joined. Ernst will have the honor of meeting Davkul. Ernst is bound and put to the fire. The smell of burnt pork fills the air, and the men around you rejoice with tears in their eyes. You see a face twisting into the smoke, knowing a visage that approves. The men are emboldened. <gasps> a lot of the men became fanatics. You love to see it. Ebrold, Volker, Markov, oh, the only guy that's not part of the cult, he's pretty pissed, but the rest, they become fanatics of Davgul. Very cool, very cool. Oh well, uh, Cash is sacrificing one of my- Oh no. <gasps> We're being attacked. Now I wish we hadn't sacrificed the guy. Fine, we'll fight him and we'll mess him up. That is a lot of lads. Come on then, bandit, step up. I'm gonna whip the heck out of you. Look, we have, we have guards and they're braver. <gasps> You, you can't just put Oscar in front of there. He's a new recruit. I feel betrayed. Oh, well, into battle we go. Blood for Davkul. We'll slip the dog and we'll start moving up. Eberold, you're a brave man. And dog, you're a cool dog, I guess. Volker, get the last dog out and schmunk that guy. Come on. Imagine being killed by the banner of an enemy. That's brutal. The dogs are still moving fast. Oh, hey, kill the man up there. Very good. And another man. These dogs were the best purchase of my life. Not only are they like adorable, but they're also really, really good. Oh, what the heck was that? You blew them up. Was that a gun? I'm impressed of, the, of these Southlanders. Although they're a bit of cowardly, you know, constantly switching me in and out. This guy is not having a good day. I'll, I'll, I'll just say that. Very good. Let's see. Any permanent injuries? That's just a pierced storm, and that's just a cut. Listen. Arms grow back, don't worry. All right, trading caravan keeps moving. We stop at nothing. Ooh, Ludolf, uh, your pierced arm muscle need to get that looked up. That's bad. A lot of us are getting wounded. That's a problem. Later. We've traveled a long way and we find ourselves in the southern lands. Our ambition is to fulfill five missions here and I've already done one. But now we're in negotiations with Atik Alasis. The master astrologer. Beasts have set upon this realm and are seeing to its destruction in a manner that I have not agreed to. Whatever terrorizes Alamar, we shall take it out. It's some sort of beast going down this way. Hyenas. Yeah, we can deal with that. That seems easy enough. Seven of them. I see. Well, we will hold off. We recruited quite a few more war dogs. That's really useful. Oh, 
Oh no, these are really fast. If I would have known, I would have switched from my throwing axes. Fearsome beasts. They have been set upon us. Switch to your blade. Hyenas, huh? They're powerful, but not too powerful. Slice at them and send out the dogs. Oh, this is gonna be bad. This is gonna be real bad. Oh, gnashing war dogs. <laughs> Fearsome beasts from the kennels of old. No. Don't kill my dogs! They're my little puppers! Don't you beasts know when to run? They retreat! Run them down! Fight these dogs to shreds! Oh oh! Dash! No, Dash is going to die! We have to kill him quick! Kill him quick! Come on! Slay them quickly! Otherwise my dog's gonna bleed to death! No! Come on, bite him! Yes! Oh! Just moments before he was gonna die! Don't tell me we lost any of the dogs! One dog, one dog, one dog! Oh, he survived! But just barely. I had some good money. A thousand and one hundred crowns. Ka-ching! Oh, while traveling on my way to Wokenberry with a bunch of supplies, a few brothers come to us looking the other world. They say that Oscar has been sitting with Markov. Markov being the only guy that's not in the cult. He's just tagging along because he's really good with the pitchfork. Listen, I will show him the darkness. Markov has joined us! Dovkul awaits us all! Oh yeah! The whole gang is following the cult now! Nice! Moral hasn't been the greatest? We got an event earlier where a bird crapped on one of our arbors and, and that guy got really sad. So we're trying to cheer him up. Next time we're at a tavern, we're gonna drink, alright? This guy doesn't have a tavern though. That, that's kinda lackluster. But you know what they do have? Rather cheap wine. I'm sure we can turn a profit on this if we sell it in the southern lands. We're on mission 2 out of 5. But so far, Dov could have not. <gasps> when I question my dark lord, he sends Birdwin as a messenger. <gasps> he joins the cause. <laughs> Who is this? Bertwin the Insane! Of course! Of course! He's here! Bertwin, my brother! Bertwin the Redeemed! When I questioned the man the most, he sent me Bertwin! Let's take our pack and go back to Al Anbar. We still have to fulfill our ambition. The southern lands have been good to us. Plenty of coin to be had. Oh? Brigands are fighting goblin raiders. We'll fight whoever survives. Yeah, we'll fight some goblins. Come here. Let's see. Four goblins against all 12 of us. Are they running? We'll send Bertwin ahead. I can't help to think that we're walking into an ambush like this. Oh, th there's one. Here they come. Look at their weapon. Nard. Terrifying. Send the dogs after him. Go, hound. Go. Bite the goblin. Bertwin, get in there. Prove yourself. More hounds! This was my favorite, this quick pop. And we'll send Thorn. Are goblins dangerous? I would assume they're like small and pitiful creatures and not to be worried about, but perhaps I'm, I'm wrong. Well, we'll fill the field with dogs. Let's see what they do. No! Strider! No! These guys are messing my dogs up! You goblin bastards! They're both almost died! My dogs! No! You goblin bastards! I hate you! I hate you so much! Avenge your fallen canine brothers, my fellow cultists! All my dogs believe in Dovkul! I hate goblins! Stupid green skin! <laughs> One of my dogs, no! My beloved dog! That's it, I'm heading south. Having arrived in a town on our way down south, I find Grimbalder the Younger flipping through a tome. Dust flutters to every page. The town has collected payment for you to stay the night. Grinning, you ask if there's a free meal with that offer. The man slowly closes the book. He looks at you rather plainly, as if he said nothing at all. There is a fear of bizarre monsters afoot. Things that feed upon dreams. I thought it the error of superstition. But they came to me. I woke in the attic praying to Davkul. What the fuck is Davkul? Gods, I know not what is going on. Heh? Well, this might be a conflict of interest, but I'm quite well versed in the matters of Dovkul. You know, as I am the cult of Dovkul. Something is haunting the village at night, so one could assume that I just keep my eyes peeled, huh? Make a camp and we just wait. Oh no! <gasps> There's something in the night! Kill it! Gentlemen, whatever we're facing, it ain't good. What the heck is that, an alp? Ah, ah, they're surrounding us! Deploy dogs! Stay in formation! We want to pin these bastards when they come. Oh, another Alp up here. God, I can hear them. They're gonna eat my dreams. Charge! What? You can't do that. They can't just change where they stand. That's not fair. No, we can't eat anyone. It's a nightmare. It's a nightmare! Whip these bastards! You're gonna split us up, more dogs! That's the only way we can win against these bastards! Try out running this! He could. 
darn it. Can we even kill them? Or we can they even be killed? Dogs, bite them. You know, it's bad when the cultists are panicking. And we gotta keep it real small. Hey, do the horn. Get some more all in you. Oh, they're ever shifting. Careful. No, seagulls. Our armor does nothing against these foes. One dead, one dead. The nightmare must end. The cultists of Dove could fear no beast. We can do this, gentlemen. The horn. It woke him up. I would also wake up if I heard. Come on, dogs, finish this. Bite him to death, dogs. That was terrifying. A waking nightmare. Oh, but the loot we got. Plentiful. And Dovkul's favor. Immense. The orbs lay in the grass. We've killed them. Money. Wow. That was, was quite a little bout, huh? Here we go. Our last delivery job. Strodov. And just like that, we fulfilled our contract. The southern lands have been good to us, but it is time for us to go a bit further north. Once again, the sect of Dalkul have been reduced to doing simple mailman work. But hey, even mailmen can have a side hustle. Um, but I'm thinking the side hustle is now the cult, not being a mailman. I have traveled to the place. You knew you were sleeping, but you knew damn well you traveled there nonetheless. Shifting in your mind, beyond your body, coursing over the earth, over the rivers. Listen. I have found Dovkul in the immutable darkness, in the inviting shade. Father and the sergeant and Knut Night Owl were already there, standing closest to you. Listen, we're not sending the sergeant. Knut, meet Dovkul. Knut the Night Owl is bound and put to the fire. The smell of burnt pork fills the air, and the men around you rejoice with tears in their eyes. Look at this! Father Brand, you became a zealot. We might have lost a real one, a real homie, but we've gained zealots of Dovkul. Very good. Know that if you die for that reason, you die like a shad, smelling of pork. Gosh darn it, I love being a blood cult. A toast for that man. <laughs> oh, Niels the Lost has joined us. Hello, Niels. Niels, you are aware that you are going to be sacrificed as soon as I figure out why and when. <laughs> oh boy, I can't wait to serve Dabkul. <laughs> Me intending to sacrifice him at the best moment possible. <laughs> what on earth are we fighting? We're protecting Eberold, this guy. He's just a noble son, but we're fighting two people. But I can't see them. Well, give the man protection. We're being paid for this, so... What is that? What the heck is that? We, we can't fight that. No! Ingolf! God damn, she got some genies on her. We have to kill her. Run! Oh, Rudolf! Oh, gosh, damn it. That, that's a powerful guy. Get the dogs on it. Get the dogs on it. Fight the witch! Get the man splitter. We're gonna split the man. We need to protect this man. Eberold. He has a hex on him. The character has been cursed to feel the same pain as another character. No! We can't kill the witch! That's a huge problem! We can't beat up the witch! We're gonna kill the man we're protecting! We have to focus on the unhold first! Ew! That's what she looks like! Damn, I can't believe I simped for her! Ah, goddamn, she got the Jiris again! My memory is very short, I'm sorry, but like, as soon as I see that popping up, I'm like, damn, why are we fighting this woman? <laughs> Listen, Eb Eberold, run! Run! We've been hired to do a job! The man entrusts us! No! Oscar, that's your own dog you're hitting! Slay the witch! <laughs> We did it! Careful, gentlemen! The Unhold! Pierce it with our banner! Slice at it! Whip it! It's dead! Oh, what a fearsome fight! Oh my lord! We're back in business! And we fulfilled ambition! Very good! And it's day 50, and our Dovkul cultists have made quite the name for themselves. Our renown is all the way up to 1,200. We're 15 cultists strong. Everyone is a loyal, faithful cultist, ready to fight for our dark lord at any moment's notice. But that's where I'm gonna end it here. Playing as a cultist in Battle Brothers has honestly been one of my favorite experiences in the game so far. So if you want me to continue this, tell me down below in the comments and give this video a like. Hope to see you guys in the next one. Until then, stay cultist, my dude. Yeet!